Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel to this sustainable Amazon kind of unboxing. So the other day I was placing my order on Amazon and I thought to myself, it would be nice to sit down with you guys and show you things that I purchased to sustain my plant-based vegan sustainable lifestyle so it's a kind of little look into how I shop. There are products that are much needed that I buy regularly and there are some really lovely brands there's also independent brands and products that I've been looking for in stores and just can't find them and haven't been buying those products sustainably because I just thought those products didn't exist when in fact they do because I found them on Amazon. I was thinking about maybe making this a bit of a regular thing maybe like once a month to show you guys what I buy. Let me know in the comments below if that's something that you want. Is that that's paint. I've still got paint in my hair. Oh God. So basically we obviously have been painting, but it's just turned into a bigger job than we planned. So it started off with my bedroom. It was kind of dull and it hadn't been painted in 10 years. So we thought let's give it a fresh lick and paint. We're obviously doing it ourselves. And then once we finished that, we realized how dull and dirty the rest of the house was. Like I said, it's been 10 years. So we're on day four. The house is a tip. I've washed my hair to do work today and clearly not done a very good job of it. I'm not going great just yet, guys. Just, you know, trying a new look. White streaks of paint in my hair. <laughs> but anyway, let's get into today's video, guys. Don't forget to subscribe and let's do this. So the first thing is a stock up on nutritional yeast. Now, those of you that are vegan and plant-based already know about this probably, but those of you that don't, you need to know this is a necessity in a plant-based person's diet and needs to be stocked in the cupboards at all times. It's full of B vitamins, specifically B12, which we need in a plant-based diet, it's very important, and also minerals that we need. It's basically a yeast, and what's so great about it as well is that it's got this cheesy, nutty taste, which is so amazing to add to dishes. So I make my carbonara with nutritional yeast. I make sauces with like cashew nutritional yeast. I'll sprinkle this on like pasta or salads. It really just is amazing and is a must in the cupboard at all times. I know a few stores stock it, Whole Foods, Planet Organic, and if you're based in London, then they are accessible. But I know not everyone has those kind of stores near them. I know Tesco's got it recently we were desperate we ran out and needed it and we heard they had it but it was really hard to get not every tesco's had it so we managed to find one so being organized and having this stocked is just a good idea so we are now stocked for probably the next month or two these are a little stock up for me. I already have them and just absolutely love them and needed to buy some more and wanted to show you. So they're these bamboo wooden teaspoon scoops. So that is a teaspoon. You can buy bigger ones that can be a tablespoon. And we pop these in literally everything. We put them in our superfood jars. So like for our cacao powder, our seeds, our nuts. We also use it in cleaning products, in our herbal teas. They're all stored in glass jars now because we don't like the have the packaging and it's more organized and it also keeps the food and products more fresh so i'll just basically pop these into the jars i might pop in a little video of me showing you but i'll just pop that in the jar and then shut the lid and then it's always there i don't have to reach for a spoon i don't have to keep re-washing the spoon that will just stay in there for me to to use and i just think they're so sweet they're from a brand called isicial i can't pronounce it but obviously i'll link it below for you but yeah like i mentioned you can get them all in different sizes i do want to get some larger sizes but for these kind of products i only need teaspoon sizes following on with the bamboo sort of theme we needed some clothes pegs and we decided to go for sustainable ones, obviously. So these are 100% biodegradable and compostable wood pegs. We also opted in both of the pegs and the bamboo scoops to have no packaging because you have that option. So that's why they're all loose like this. With our utility and kitchen products, we've really been making sure that we're only buying recycled sustainable bamboo. We just prefer the more neutral tones anyway. It's better suited to our aesthetic and obviously it's sustainable. So it just works both ways. And I was so pleased to see that they had just simple bamboo recycled compostable biodegradable pegs which is so great because you know sometimes the pegs may break and then they fall on the ground and then you forget about them i remember that when i was little and you'd find them in the ground like months and years later you know you don't have to worry about these ones so i can now put them in my little peg bin that i have this one's actually old and then I've got my pegs. The next thing's a bit of a luxury buy. I just thought after we've painted and decorated, it would just be lovely to burn a beautiful, 100% natural, organic soya candle. This is from a brand called Jonathan Ward and the scent is Fig Ultimatum, which is 
one of my favorites that they do. It has cassis, green fig, ginger, date, patchouli, sandalwood, amber, iris, and musk in it. And it is just absolutely incredible. I can already smell the candle and I've not even opened it and I've not even burnt it. And that's because premium fragrance oils have been used. I'm very particular with candles because non-soya candles usually have a lot of chemicals in them and that's burnt into your breathing space and you're breathing that all in and it's just not good for you. So if you love candles like I do, then really invest in a good quality one. This this one burns for between 35 and 45 hours so you get a long burn time out of it and let me show you what it looks like because it just is such oh, guys I literally can't wait until the house is finished I can burn this it just smells amazing but this is what the candle looks like once you're done you have this beautiful glass that you can reuse you can even maybe make your own candle in it or i just use them as drinking glasses nothing goes to waste it literally is an experience there are so many other scents so you can sort of travel through them this is like i said one of my favorite jonathan does so many and i know he brings new ones out quite often i've met jonathan i've been to where he makes the candles and he is just such an amazing person he's very passionate about his products it's an independent brand which is so lovely and I just find that so authentic I just think knowing that behind the brand as well is just an added extra so I thoroughly recommend for you guys to check this out and treat yourself it's also a really lovely gift idea if there's anybody you really want to treat then it, this is a good one this one's another stock up and it's on toilet paper so we use the cheeky panda it's free from tissue dust fragrance pesticides chlorine bleach and BPA and yes if you didn't know that's all in your regular toilet paper you don't want that going anywhere down there this is made from natural bamboo it's ultra sustainable it's hypoallergenic and it's protecting rainforests like I said it's made from 100% natural and sustainable bamboo so obviously we like to stock up on these and we stay very far away from your regular toilet paper we're quite fond of this brand we actually get the tissues i have them sitting there on the side table also tissues to put in your bag they also do wet wipes because we know how unsustainable normal wet wipes are but, uh, cheeky panda do sustainable ones and biodegradable ones so yeah stocked up on toilet paper because you Never want to run out of that. I swear, we're always stocking up. Next up is some soap. Tommy is circling me. Can I help you, Tommy? Can I help you? Hmm? We have been using soap for the longest time now. A brand that we are quite enjoying is called Faith in Nature and it's 100% natural. And I find with soaps, even if they say natural, they're not always natural. So you really have to be careful. But this brand is, it's a handmade soap and it has no SLS or parabens. So I got the grapefruit, the rosemary and the aloe vera. And I use the different scents depending on what my skin needs at the time. And obviously with these, the packaging is already recycled and you can recycle it. And yeah, there's no chemicals in here or anything like that. One of the products haven't arrived, which is so annoying, but what I'm gonna do is insert a little video of me unpackaging it and showing you, but it's basically from a brand called Eco Femini, and it's called the Zofu, like tofu with a Z. It's a zero waste tofu box, tofu making kit and tofu press. Make your own tofu includes muslin cloth. Those of you that follow me on Instagram and are subscribed for a while will know that I like to make everything from scratch. I just prefer it. I know what's going in my food in every single way. And when I saw this, I was like, yes, that's a challenge. I've never made tofu before and I would absolutely love to try. And it's also a tofu press so that you know when you wanna get the water out of the tofu, then you can do that. But it's a shame it's not here that I can show you, but like I said, it will be linked here for you guys. This is actually a small business too. The lady's name is Lucy and she was just such a delight to speak to when I was asking her about the product. So make sure you guys go and check it out but I will be sure to update you guys and obviously share recipes and maybe even my own tofu recipe for you guys very soon. So keep your eyes peeled. Another necessity in the kitchen or in the utility cupboard are these amber dark glass jars or not jars but spray bottles so you have the spray part there and then you've got the glass 
amber jar. Since we have been making all our own cleaning products, also like hair products, so we make this like rosemary rinse. I just stocked up on them. I'll obviously link these below like everything else. If you're becoming more sustainable and self-sufficient, then these kind of jars are the best. These, jo these kind of jars are also for like your herbs and anything like that because it reflects the light, it protects the product inside. So whatever you've made will last longer and just stay more potent or nutritious depending what's in it. I actually want to get the pump bottles. They are proving to be quite hard to find so I will update you if I find the pump bottles because I want them for like hand wash and stuff like that. Since plastic containers and all that is just a big no-no now and we don't really have much of it left. We opt for more glass and glass bottles and stuff like that. It's really important to clean them properly. So we needed some bottle brush sets and I saw these it's from a brand called Bamboo, which I have some other bits from them. They're really, really good. They do so many convenient products that you really, really need in the home. You can see that we have all different brush sizes to get into those jars and clean them. I know I've got one jar where I store my almond milk and that can be a bit of a struggle sometimes to get in and clean. So they have this hook so you can hang them up um, so they store quite nicely as well. I got another product from Bamboo and it's their bamboo cutlery set. So we are possibly hoping that we are going to get away this year, but we are going to drive. We'd like to go to Italy and also Poland. And obviously we take our own food when we travel. We always do. To have a cutlery set to hand to avoid single use and just any cutlery in general. I just don't like the idea with this whole virus being about using cutlery that other people have put in their mouths and used in general. I don't trust that things are cleaned properly. I'm quite OCD like that. So I just wanted a cutlery set that was just mine. So this set has your spoon, your knife, fork. It's even got a straw and it's actually got a straw cleaner as well. So you can clean the straw on the go. This is also really great for work, even if you don't take your own lunch in, just to not use the single use or public cutlery. This is just such a better option. And if you are making your own food at work, or make me very happy that you are, then this is just a necessity. So I picked up this in, this is Colour Lagoon. They come in all different colours. So I got a few of these, so we are all set and we've got our cutlery on the go. It will last such a long time and I'll always have it. It's dishwasher safe, food grade certified, and it has a vegetable oil finish. So yeah, I'll be taking this wherever I go. The next thing I got is actually something new. So we don't want to be using cling film and foil anymore. So I saw these plant wax food wraps. Reusable waxed organic cloth roll. Vegan, 100% biodegradable. The brand is Sea Sky Rock. This is a one meter roll. It's a closer step to being plastic free. We are getting there, but I'll just open it up for you to see. And even me, this is what it looks like and you just use that instead. It's completely reusable. You can wash it and just use it over and over again. Like I said, this is the first time that I've purchased this, so I haven't used it yet, but I will definitely keep you guys updated over on my Instagram. But I just thought this was such an important purchase. Cling film is just not great to be using and throwing away, using and throwing away. We are down to very minimally using cling film because we just store everything in glass, but there are just some times that you do need it. So I'm not buying cling film anymore and I'm using plant wax food wrap. I mentioned before that we make our own cleaning products. So we really want our cleaning tools to be sustainable and eco. We needed like a scourer and search and search and search and we found this. And this is a coconut scourer with a bamboo handle. I love it because it has a handle. I don't like touching, you know, when you have the sponges and your fingers and nails all get wet and ruined. So I love that it has a handle. It's so pleasing to the eye and like I mentioned, just suits us to a T. There are still some natural cleaning tools that I'm still on the lookout for. We haven't completed our set, but I'll obviously let you guys know in the next video when I do one. The last thing I ordered was much needed. So it's a brand called Soft Mild. It's a hairbrush. I broke my hairbrush maybe two or three months ago. And I've been using Stefania's and I think she thought it would just be for a couple of weeks and it turned into a couple of months. And I think she just wants her hairbrush back. <laughs> I haven't stolen it, but it's annoying when somebody uses your hairbrush. I just thought, 
Let me see if they've got any sustainable hairbrushes, and they do. It's Soft Mild, it must be, that's the, um, the brand name on the handle. It is this paddle brush, and the back has this very lovely etched in floral pattern. Oh, wow. Steph, this is better than yours. I'm honestly so impressed with this hairbrush. Like my hair, the longer it gets, it gets so tangled. And then when it comes to combing, it just rips. And this is just gliding through. Let me read the description for you. So it's a eco-friendly, natural wooden bamboo paddle hairbrush for long, short, curly, thick, thin hair. So for all hair types, men, women, kids, for everyone, unless you're bored. Actually, you could use this for your board. It's scalp massaging. So you could just massage your scalp, which is I'm just gonna do that while I'm talking to you. Oh, that's lovely. It reduces tangle and hair breakage, which I have just found out. And it promotes hair growth, of course, with the massaging that stimulates your hair follicles and the gliding through the ends of your hair, not causing any breakage. It's gonna allow your hair to just get healthier, which is what I needed, especially for my ends. I'm so pleased with this product. There's actually more in the box. There's a little headband which is cute, and you have a comb, which is super useful. I can't believe how cheap that was. Like I said, it was about eight or nine pounds and you get all of that. I'm gonna keep you guys updated on my hair journey with this brush. I'm actually gonna do a little hair video for you guys as well to just share how I naturally look after my hair, but this is definitely getting added into the mix. Guys, we have come to the end of this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know, comment below if you want to see more videos like this from me. I will do them monthly, every time I do my order on Amazon. Can you believe how many sustainable plant-based products there were in this one video. Like I couldn't believe it myself when I looked at my basket and saw how many things I put in it. But it just shows you that the products are out there and they are available. So I hope, like I said, this video has helped you see that and saved you a bit of time. Guys, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this week's video. Please remember to subscribe to my channel. I'm also over on Instagram. It's at Honestly Alessandra, where you can keep up with me daily and see me talking about and using a lot of the products that I've shown you today amongst a lot of other other sustainable and plant-based things. So come say hey over there and I will see you guys next week. Bye guys!